Well, good morning. Well, I decided to grab a kit and start something to get the mojo flowing again so I can get back into the groove. And uh, I grabbed an old uh, Airfix kit that's been in my stash for probably 20 years. Uh, the kit's from the 60s and it's the Royal Navy uh, Vosper NTB motor torpedo boat. So I started this about two days ago and uh, let me tell you, there's some, uh, you can definitely tell it's a kit from the 60s. Um, the plastic is way, way soft. Um, you can pinch this together when it's, when it's apart. So I glued the top, got it all in there, nice tight seams in here, a little bit of fill. And then I had to go in and take a hot glue gun and reinforce all the way around this thing. You can see it inside there to give it some stiffness. Um, pretty detailed little kit all together. Um, I know they've been around for a while. So I've been working on the hull and some other pieces. Um, adding a little bit of detail like the little lines right here. Cover up the seams and uh, I added some pipes coming out for the exhaust on both sides give it a little more of a real feel. It's just a hole drilled in the side and then uh, gives it something a little more extra. Um, lots of little injection marks. There was a line across here that I had to smooth out. Um, say lots of injection points and marks and everything else. Got the cockpit pretty much done. Ready to rock and roll. Got a few little pieces to add on there and do some cleanup on that. The torpedo launchers, those are a fun little tool. Um, two piece, big seams down the middle, and then uh, you can see it right there. There's some pretty fine detail that you got to try to save. Uh, the little plastic piece that was in here was supposed to be a round tube, it was more flat. So I took a piece of brass and made a new one so that it's there. And it actually has torpedoes coming out of the end. I took one and played around with it and I ushi powdered it and it looks really cool sticking out there as a silver point. Um, there were a few pieces missing out of this one. I think there's two life rings missing. But like I say, this plastic is soft, soft, soft. It's kind of cool because it actually uh, comes with some figures to go along with the kit. They're pretty well done. Looks like a five-man crew on there. It's like our U.S. Navy Elko boats, PT boats. So I've been playing around with that for the last two days and trying to get the, the mojo flowing again. So that is my little update on the Vosper MTB boat. It's a 172 scale. So keep watching and uh, we'll see how this thing turns out. You guys have a good day.